Hi guys, in today's video, I'm going to show with you guys a simple tip to fix the issue with the make file. So I have a simple make file right here and inside I have just single command to echo hello world text. And when I'm trying to run this make files or run this command by using make and then the name of the command is hello. I got the issue saying make files missing separators and then stop. Even I'm running make clear, it's saying same issue, missing separator and stop. Um, so I figure out that the issue is for the make file, they're using tab as separator instead of space. So when we do coding, mostly we use space as a common practice to separate the words. But for the make file, they're using tab instead of space. So I'm going back to the Visual Studio and I do having the make file extension for the Visual Studio VS Code. So I'm open up it right here. What I can do is I'm going to update the setting in the VS Code to use tab as separator instead of the space. The way I do that is I using the combination of three key control shift and P to open up this shirt box. All you can use the menu is view and then command palette and then it's going to show up the same search box and you're going to search for the convert and you select the second option which is convert identification to tabs so using this one I'm going to make the separator is tab if you want you can rewrite the make file and when you highlight the content of the make file you see that it's showing the tab I'm not sure you can see it but there's a small arrow right here to show it is a tab and you can see that when you rewrite the file. So let me see, hello. And then here, and I tap echo, and then say hello world. That's it, and I save the file. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna commit this file to Git and then run it again. So you can see that I already commit the new file using the tab separator to the Git repository. And now I'm going to run it on the running environment with make. You can see that I updated it to the repository right here. So I just do a git pull to update the make files and now I run the command again. Make hello. So you can see that right now I can run it successfully. It's showing up the hello world right here. I can run it one more time. It's running successfully. So that is how you fix the issue saying missing separator and you fix this by going to the Visual Studio and then select Control shift p type convert and select the option of convert identification to tab instead of the space and uh, after that you can update the make file and run it successfully i hope this tip helping you to resolve the issue missing separator stop if you think it's helpful please support like the video and subscribe to my channel to support producing the content like this thank you bye Nếu các bạn thấy hay, các bạn hãy nhấn nút like và subscribe, đăng ký để ủng hộ Easy Tech Class nha. Cảm ơn các bạn nhiều.